In the last video we selected fonts from Google Fonts. In this one we're going to add it to the HTML. Now one thing I've done is I've actually commented out my bootstrap. You don't need to do that. Commenting out means that the browser doesn't read it but the code is still there if I need it later. And a comment is pointy bracket um, exclamation mark two hyphens at the start and then afterwards you've got two hyphens and a closing pointy bracket and that basically hides the code from the browser because that way we can see the original ugly font of Times New Roman because this is what we're going to change. Bootstrap has a default font of Open Sans and depending on what font you're choosing it can be hard to see if it's applying or not so I want to make it fairly obvious. So now we go back to Google fonts. These are the ones that I chose earlier, light and bold. Now one other thing I'm going to do is go to Roboto Condense, my body text font, and I'm also going to choose um, regular 400. So I'll select that style. Actually I'm going to choose the 400 italic because that way I can choose, show you two things when we apply it to CSS later. So now these are the fonts I have selected. If I change my mind and want to get rid of one, I just hit the minus or you can go remove all. But now we want to move from review to embed. So I'm clicking on embed and this is the code that we want. This is the link tag. Select it, copy it, go back to Dreamweaver and we just pop it in here. And I'll just um, indent that a little bit so it's a bit neater. Great, so now we have the code and we can see we've got Roboto Condensed, we have Italic available and we have it at the weight of 300 and 400. We have Roboto Slab and that one we've just got as the weight 700 which is bold. So all of this is ready for our next video where we are going to show you how to add this in the CSS because you can see it hasn't added it here yet. All this link does is tell the browser where to find it. It doesn't tell it how to apply it. We need CSS for the visual style.